Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. The Lord bless everyone joining in the name of Jesus. This is the day the Lord has made that we should rejoice and be glad. And this prophetic title says, This is just the beginning. Run for your life. He says, This is just the beginning. Run for your life. Wherever you're watching me, God bless you. This is just the beginning. Run for your life. This man is evil. This man has an evil intention. This particular prophetic word is a direction, and God is revealing to set someone free from mess. Hallelujah. Wherever you're watching or connecting, God bless you. If this is your first time seeing my face or coming across this YouTube channel, these prophetic blessings, may the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. Uh, can we start by subscribing, liking, and sharing as we are receiving this word? Can we pray together? Father, we thank you for a day like this. We give you glory, honor, in the name of Jesus. Amen. So, this particular prophetic word is talking of this is just the beginning. You must run for your life. This man is after your life. This man want to do something which is not good this relate this particular prophetic word is going to a couples that they're about to lay a foundation of a relationship one thing i always tell us a relationship the strength of any relationship lies on the foundation and there are time and moment hours of which the foundation of a relationship is being laid they laid the foundation on a relationship from the very beginning so whenever you meet a man or a woman, the first thing you do is to lay the foundation. The foundation is what will sustain the relationship. So the strength of every building lies on the foundation. The same way the strength of any, every relationship also lies on the foundation. God bless you in the name of Jesus. So this particular prophetic word is going as a warning. You know there are some women and some men that they will always say, I, sh I better die with my spect. I better go for what I want. I better, I better, I better. Listen to me. I've, I'm talking, I'm recording this particular word as an advice to somebody, as a man. There are some things that the moment you sense it in any relationship or in anything, that you're about to do is a confirmation from the Lord. Somebody like me, whenever I'm doing something, I do not care to know what people say or talk. One, when I have the peace of mind. Two, when I feel safe, when I feel belonging, God is asking me to be there. The moment I'm sitting somewhere, my spirit is not there, automatically I will leave that place. That is how I am with God. So one, if you're with a relationship as a woman, if you are into a relationship as a woman, from the very beginning, this man start maltreating you, start beating you, start like a man is still dating you, he's slapping you, he's beating you, he's maltreating you, then yet you are still there saying he will change. Listen to me, my dear. Nobody has the power to change anybody. The only thing we can do is to pray for the state of the heart to be changed. And God is the one that has the power to change any man. If from the relationship, which is the foundation, you cannot be able to lay a good foundation. You go into the relationship with that man, you will die. The man will kill you. So this particular prophetic word is talking for you to run for your life. This is just the beginning. Run for your life. It's going to a woman. I'm seeing a woman. You have already peeled. You just enter into this relationship. You can't sleep, sleepless night. Headache, persecution, problems. Your life is from one mess to the other. You're crying every day. You're asking yourself questions. You don't know what is going on. There are people you encounter. Your life will change from good to bad. There are people you encounter. Your life change from bad to good. The Bible says the moment Jonah stepped into the boat, the boat began to sink. The problem was not the river. The problem was not the boat. The problem was not their goods. But the people lose their things. They threw away their things. The problem was Jonah. There are some people that come into your life 
they become as a burden to you, problems to you, then you lost a lot of things. Please, want to advise you, somebody watching and connecting, the foundation of your relationship lies from the very beginning. Don't just be moved because the man will just come before you pretending, telling you, I'll buy you shawarma, I will do this, I'll do this. Then you, you just agree, no. No. There are some things you need to put the foundation. The strength of any building is the foundation. The moment you put a solid foundation, the man will value you. The man will respect you. Along the line, there are some breach and some situation whereby only the foundation can sustain the beauty. There are moments in, in relationship, problems will come, battle will come, temptation will come. But when the woman turns back and look at the foundation, she will, she will stay. When the man turns back and look at the foundation, she cannot tell you go. But if there is no foundation, the man can look on your face and ask you to go. God bless you all family. In the name of Jesus. I'm just led by the Spirit of God to record this particular advice for somebody. This is actually what you have been passing through. You have been facing this just as you just started your relationship. God is asking you to be very careful. Hallelujah. You must run for your life. If a man has not married you, he's maltreating and beating you. When you enter his house, he will pound you. He will deal with you. Better make your decision now in the name of Jesus. Once more, happy new month. I want to use this opportunity to thank each and every one of us for your love, your support through this ministry in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Please, if you come across this video and if you have noticed something wrong on this channel, please, at the comment section, you can drop it there. I'll go to the comment section to read it. Hallelujah. And if you're led by the Spirit of God to say, Man of God, happy new month. There are a lot of means that God has that social media, internet has made it possible for us to support the work of God. You can support financially, you can support through Super Tan, Super Chat, Super Stickers, through PayPal. Hallelujah. As you're watching me, tap the dollar sign button. Whatever thing you want to say, man of God, happy new month. You want to support the grace of God and push this ministry forward financially. As you're doing so, God bless you. Somebody, you're saying, man of God, I want to support through PayPal. The link is on this platform. Is it mobile money? The mobile money, the ministry account is still on this platform. God bless you. As you're doing so, God bless you. Thank you so much. Once more, happy new mom family. I love you all. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching this beautiful prophetic word. For in Jesus' name, amen. I pray may this word be a direction to someone that was about to lay a wrong foundation. For in Jesus' name, amen. Please don't forget to bless someone by sharing. And please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you, family, for watching. For in Jesus' name, amen.